What's up everyone, back again with yet another video, yet another intro from the car for your head tops. How are you guys doing? Back with more foodie content. So today guys, we're actually about to get some dessert. It's a special dessert place, so say. I've never been there, but it's basically like a designated dessert, dessert restaurant. And I think they do waffles, they do crepes, they do ice cream, all that kind of good shit. Uh, My head back. Sorry. Guys, I don't like to swear in front of the kids. I try not to do it. Sometimes it slips out, so apologies, Aurora. You know not to repeat what I just said, right? If you can just take a minute also, just like this video, please watch it all the way through, and also subscribe to the channel. The sub count's like a little bit low. Views are amazing though, so I appreciate you guys for watching all the way through. Anyway, guys, we've got a couple of errands to run first, and we also gotta wait for this one to wake up, because I know if I take her out, put her in the, in the push chair, She's probably going to wake up, so I might just let her sleep for a minute. But anyway, stay tuned, guys. We're going to go and get some dessert in a minute, and we're going to go to the game. It's first, and it's going to be... Yeah. 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 All right, guys, so we're out here in these streets. These Bristol... Well, actually, no, we're not in Bristol. We're in uh, another town at the moment, but we are about to go to Casper. Casper's, my bad, Casper's. Pretty cool seat in there, right? See, it, someone's smiling. Someone's smiling, someone's happy to be in there, aren't you? Casper's the ice cream shakes, crepes, waffles and coffee. Yeah, it's pretty cool what they've done with it. Got the signs, the pink stuff everywhere. It smells really good as well. Let's see what they've got on the menu. The, the menu, yeah, very overwhelming. There's a lot of stuff on it. I've kind of played it safe and simple and I've gone for Oreo, I've gone for Oreo waffles and there's like some other stuff sprinkled on top of it. I'm not sure exactly what it is. I can't remember basically, but it does look pretty good. Aurora here, she's gone for a just a basic waffle with some marshmallow and maple syrup. So we kind of played it safe with Aurora because she's got a very mild peanut allergy, so we don't want to be giving her anything too sort of heavy and chocolatey just in case because there are nuts on the premises, but it's very mild. She does eat things with traces of nuts, so it's not a problem, so so I've got a large, a large, a large, what's a large, a large, a large latte here. It looks a little bit kind of weak to me. I have a bit of a coffee head guys, so I'm going to be very critical of this. If it's in enough standards, it's huge, but it looks a little bit weak to me. It's not bad. It's quite like, um, it's definitely like a creamy latte, but... Not very strong. I could have done with an extra shot of coffee in that, but it's all right. It's not bad. It's bad. Right, food's here, looking pretty good. Or has got this waffle with some marshmallows, with some ice cream. What's the ice cream saying? Quite good. And this is my Oreo uh, waffles, I guess. I, I don't know. It's white chocolate Oreo. What's this? Is this? Is that ice cream? That's ice cream. It's pretty good. You literally look like a little princess sat there on that seat with your waffle and your ice cream. Have you have you got a rating out of ten for the ice cream yet? Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Does look like you're enjoying it. Rai Rai just got a little bit of waffle. We don't want to go crazy with Rai Rai and the sugar because she's obviously small. All right, look, you got waffle there. Eat your waffle, bro. Waffle. Waffle, yeah. It's dessert. All right, look. Let's see what this is saying. So we've got very soft, soft waffles. Na, 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 na. I like the waffles because they're like, they're not too chewy. They just literally just melt in your mouth. It's got a very strong white chocolate flavor, which I wasn't really expecting. I thought Oreos is going to be more of the sort of dark crumbly chocolate stuff. But... Mm. Absolute sugar bomb this is. This is the sort of food that sends kids, kids nuts, guys. Sugar. Mm, mm, fighting over food. This is good. Hello, white chocolate. White chocolate is the overwhelming flavour. But we have got a bit of this gelato ice cream as well. Mm. 
gelato is banging. I don't know what gelato is. Is gelato like kind of mix? I know it's ice cream, but is it like a certain flavour? Is it a mix of flavours? That's good with the gelato. Yeah, I'm not sure what gelato is. Nice, that sets it right off. Guys, I got, I'm not going to lie, I've got a bit of a sweet tooth. I do like stuff. I'd rather have this after like maybe something savoury. I'm more of a savoury person, but I do have a sweet tooth. The waffle with the ice cream. That is the one, and that is banging. We're all going to be buzzing after this. The ice cream makes all the difference, that's what it needs. I don't know what it's about. The coffee and something sweet just goes from, like, hand in hand, doesn't it? How's yours, Aurora? It looks like that waffle's going down pretty well. Yeah, Aurora's got some of mine. Aurora keeps the marshmallows. That's why I've given her a little bit of ice cream and something just to sort of distract her with. What do you rate that out of 10? Eight or nine. You definitely look like a little princess, like you're enjoying yourself there. So we had a bit of a scary incident in IHOP in Orlando years ago when I was about three. She actually choked on a waffle. She put too much in her mouth, she couldn't swallow it. Um, and she had to go to the toilet and she eventually puked it all up. But it was a scary moment where I thought, like, that waffle's not coming up, she's going to choke. So whenever I see kids eating waffles now, I'm a little bit helicopter parent just checking her every mouthful. Take your time with that, Laura. 908 calories in this. It says on the menu, that's a lot of calories. That's a hell of a lot of calories for one meal. Just for a dessert meal with no nutrition as well. So, so that's it guys, that's most of the food gone. I couldn't do all extra ice cream. Pretty good, but the guilt factor is kicking in now. I'm feeling a little bit guilty for eating all of that. And I feel like ever so slightly sick, I guess not. I don't feel like I'm gonna puke, but you know that feeling where you just know you've overindulged, it's that feeling. So what's wrong with you, bro? What's wrong with you? Got too much in one go, not all of it in one go. Take your time. Definitely feeling like I've overindulged a little bit there. I don't know about you, or are you feeling alright? You're not feeling like you're gonna puke or nothing? No. Nah. I don't think we're gonna puke, but it's very sweet and sickly, but I would recommend it. If you guys want a good dessert spot, I don't know, kids treat, birthday, whatever, something you're gonna, you want to take your kids to every day or even every week, you know, it's an occasional thing, but it is pretty good, it's pretty good, so I recommend Casper's, I think they got them everywhere in the UK, as far as I know, I probably need to fact check that, but I know there's a few around our city, and I think they've got them in most places, so yeah, definitely recommend it, if you're in the UK, check out Casper's restaurant. Alright guys, I appreciate you watching this short, sweet video, guys, next time you see me, I'm not going to be here in Bristol. I'm actually going to be on the road, believe it or not. I'm not going to be... on the road? All right, I'm not going to be in the road, but I'm not going to be in the country. I'm going to be somewhere else with you and food. I've got some exciting content coming your way, guys. Like, exciting for me anyway, and I'm sure you guys would be happy to see where I'm going, what I'm doing, what kind of food I'm going to be reviewing. Uh, there's going to be some lifestyle content. We're not just going to be doing food stuff. We're going to be doing lifestyle stuff while we're out there in said place. And I appreciate you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in another video very soon. The end!